guys, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new. Today's video is an extreme cleaning style video. We are just a few days shy of Christmas and my to-do list is astronomical. My house has been completely neglected, enjoying the holidays with my kids and that's how it should be, but I have to tackle this mess now because once we unwrap everything, there's nowhere for it to go except more mess and more chaos. I still have to go in my kids' room, clean out some of the old stuff as well, make space for all that. I'm just gonna bring you guys along with me. If you haven't already, hit that red subscribe button, stick around, and let's get started. Also, any random noises you hear in the background when I'm talking, my neighbors are getting a pool put in, and because it's finally a beautiful day here, we do have the windows open, so for any background noise, I do apologize, that's my neighbors getting their pool put in. And then as far as with me today, I am doing this a relaxed home style video. The hair is just brushed, there is no makeup, and I'm in pajamas because I'm not wasting any more time, I'm just getting the house done. The living room is not bad as per usual, just fixing up the couch, but I did get a lint roller thing online to try on that couch, I'm gonna show you guys that in a little while, but I did learn a new reason to not buy expensive throw pillows, because with a new puppy, there's now holes in my throw pillow, if you see it right there. Yep, he tossed it around the other day, got his nail right in it and ripped it with no problem, so I will stick with my $5 throw pillows. Luckily, the dining room is not dirty. I have to put my vacuum away, and this is my husband's work clothes I just to put away, but then this area is completely clean. The kitchen, I do have a load of dishes, but all of that will fit in the dishwasher, and the dishwasher is empty, so that will not take me long. I do have to clean the mixer because my daughter made cupcakes and left the mess for me, but she also made a mess all over the hand mixer, so I have to wash that down as well. But I do have some garbage disposer, cleaner things I wanna try. I found these for I think like 350 on Amazon and I've heard great things. This little thing right here I found in Marshalls. Yeah, Marshalls. I wanna talk about this too. Also on the list, laundry as per usual. We have a family of seven. Laundry never ends around here, so I do have that to do, as well as I'll be scrubbing down the master bathroom, and I don't know if the guest bathroom needs it or not, but that might also be showing up too. But the first thing I will be knocking out is the kids' rooms. That way, just in case this video carries on into the night, I'm not messing around their area. They'll be able to go to bed later, and I can work my way this way as the day goes on. Declan has a bunch of tiny toy buckets under his bed that he doesn't really play with anymore and I'm right now sorting through anything that's broken or he doesn't touch that I can either trash or donate and I actually did get a pretty good amount of the stuff knocked out which I'm very grateful for but of course then he comes in the room and starts trying to take things back because he claims he plays with them. And then in the girls' room, they have baskets on top of their closet, which is all of Brianna's toys, and then stuff down below in the closet, which is like a mixture of the two girls' stuff. And they have not been sorted through since we moved into this house. So Brianna had a lot of toys she never touches anymore, Barbies, dolls, a whole bunch of stuff like that. She had to clear out and get rid of, and then all of Gwen's stuff, she saw toys in here from, you know, like a six-month-old baby type toy. So we were able to clear a decent amount of this out too. Both kids bedrooms are done. One of these bags is donate, one is trash, and then that thing right there, the playpen, I have to trash it because I did cut the side out of it and make it like a, a little fort for Gwen. So I do have to trash that one, I can't donate it. But at least their rooms are cleared out, ready for all the new stuff. They're both cleaning their rooms right now because they're a disaster from sorting through everything. But I'm gonna go spray the bathroom down with some cleaner, let it sit while I get more cleaning done. I reviewed this shower cleaner in one of my TikTok videos. It didn't work very well for me, but I'm trying it again because everybody said it's fantastic, so keep trying. And I'm going to put some Lysol in the toilet bowl and let that sit for a while. Both of these are gonna stay while I go clean something else. The dishwasher, I'm gonna fill it up as much as I can, but if you're watching me as I'm doing this, you'll see my puppy come over, starts licking all the plates and everything, so I did stop loading that dishwasher and went back to it a little bit later. Don't care about 
about no goals, no one else to hit my phone up. None of that pretentious life. No, 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 don't need no pills to get high. There's no doubt in my mind. Your love is all that I need. Yes, you right there, mister, one of the reasons I bought this thing. All right, this is a Chom Chom roller, no sticky tape type of pet hair remover. I have no idea, saw it on Amazon with like thousands and thousands of reviews. So we're gonna give this a try because adding him here and a hunter already shedding, yeah, we're gonna fix this. It's getting closer to midnight. I tried to get closer to you. Drinking courage from my red cup now. If this is your first visit to my channel today, welcome. I'm so happy you guys are here. These are the videos that I make typically is cleaning, motherhood, vlogs, anything like that to show you that you think your life is chaotic and messy and that it's not normal. It is. We are all on the struggle bus together and that's what my channel is. It's a lot of fun, tips, tricks, anything to make your life a little easier and a little more fun. If that sounds good to you, consider hitting that subscribe button and joining because it is so much fun over here on my channel. I really like this thing. Look at how much dog hair it picked up and it was not very much effort at all. No sticky sheets to mess with. All you gotta do is wipe down that red piece if it's not sticking too well with a microfiber cloth or something and you're good to go. Fantastic little gadget. the bathroom the toilet I always clean from the cleanest area to the dirtiest area I use disposable antibacterial wipes just because I hate trying to keep track of which microfiber I use to clean the toilet and washing them separately and eh, it's just it's not for me so I use disposable antibacterial wipes and I'm out of my Clorox wands and I cannot find the refills in Walmart or Target near me I don't know if they're in a shortage so I am just using a normal toilet brush here And then to help me with my shower doors and my mirrors in here, I'm using my glass cleaner and then the microfiber on the Swiffer that I've showed you guys before. I love it, it just makes everything so much faster and easier. a couple hours later I had to cook dinner and re-clean up the kitchen from dinner so now I'm actually going to try this stuff right here I have done this before years ago and these are this is the company I use for like the disposable wipes I use but when I found this thing right here in Marshall's it was $3.99 I was like okay it's actually made to work with this and hopefully make it an easier process but you still have to spray it down with this use one side of this to wipe it flip it over and use the other side of it to like buff it in and shine. So at least I don't have two different cloths that I'm running back and forth with and 
I'm just, I'm hoping it's worth it. Oh, also then once I'm done with the stainless steel, I'm going to do the garbage disposal and I'm definitely gonna have you guys on music for that because that sound is just atrocious. And then I will be going back in to finish the master bathroom. Yeah, I like this thing. It has the scrubbing cleaning side and then the polishing side. Really, really easy. Watching this back and as I'm editing, I honestly forgot just how much the puppy gets in the way when you're cleaning around a house. He is in everything. Everywhere I go in this video, he is right there trying to eat the cloth, lick the cleaner, it doesn't matter. He is right there beside me the entire time. Well, I did have more cleaning plan to do with you guys in this video, but mom life is winning. My youngest is starting to get sick and all she wants to do is be clingy and need mommy and daddy. So cleaning is done, she wins. I'm gonna go take care of her. Thank you guys so much for watching this one. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you're not already and I will see you in the next one. Bye guys. Bye.